Recognize him? That's King Neptune. You know, one of the coolest things about Cape Charles is when it comes to having fun in the bay, you have so many options. Katie recently visited our friends at Southeast Expeditions, and as you're about to see, whether you're sitting in a kayak or standing on a paddleboard, you're bound to have a blast. Whether you want to paddle sitting down, watch my style, or do so standing up. I wanna, like, are my feet in a good spot? Yeah, yeah, they're great. Okay, all right. Southeast Expeditions offers you the opportunity to muscle through the Chesapeake Bay one stroke at a time. Anything where uh, your own body is your motor, we're, we're, we're into it. Both calm ways to explore a diverse body of water. Am I going the right way? No, I'm perfect. Hard to get lost out here. <laughs> well, what's really unique here is we're on the Chesapeake Bay right now, and that's going to have you know, these, all these tidal creeks, a lot of aquaculture, stuff like that, um, and then just houses tucked into the sort of banks of the forest. But then you travel 10 miles to the east and you're on the seaside. Um, it's actually part of the longest stretch of undeveloped coastline on the entire east coast is Virginia Eastern Shore seaside. Um, so that's gonna be, you know, all these salt marshes, um, untouched barrier islands, and that's really, really unique paddling. Folks can either rent a kayak or paddleboard and plot their own course, or sign up for guided tours. Those will be a combination of sport and school. We sort of act as naturalists and just sort of, you know, interpret, you know, what's going on out here and just get people out in the water to places they wouldn't normally go to. So that's actually an osprey nest up and to the right. Um, so those are sort of big seafaring birds or sort of fishermen who will dive and catch fish with these huge talons they have. No one's home at the moment. No one's home. And then all at the base, you see all these oysters around here. Um, and I talk about oysters on a lot of my tours. They're really good for the water quality. So one oyster can filter feed up to 50 gallons of water a day and just clean it right up. And these ain't your average tours. One leads you to wine by way of water. We claim it as the world's first kayak winery tour. Not sure if that's true or not, but um, basically we start at one of the local boat ramps a bit north of us, um, paddle the Chatham Vineyards, which is really, you know, one of the only wineries out here. They've got um, really good wine. We paddle out there, sample that wine. Um, so sort of, you know, you get to experience the water and get to experience a bit of the land out there. Say cheers. Or perhaps checking out a sunset is more your style. Their tours will take you there, too. We just hang out, watch the sunset, and that to me models most like what me and my friends would do here. Of course, you'll be swept away by the sights and sounds, but what will make it extra special is its intimacy. So here we'll do these trips and not see a single other kayaker or boater for the whole day. Um, and just sort of that small size, like, you know, getting to know the people out there. I don't feel like I'm gonna get too far. You might be surprised to learn that it won't take you too long to get a handle both sitting at water level. Yeah, it's like level six kayaking. I feel like it's level six at least. And standing on top of it. Now we're cooking. As close to walking on water as it gets. It takes no time at all to go from nervous. Just go with the flow. Just go with, oh, yeah. Okay. To fearless. I've had maybe one or two people flip this whole summer, and that's been on our uh, kayak winery tour, so don't over imbibe and you'll be fine. Seriously, it's smooth sailing. Your dismount may not win you any gold medals. Okay, we did it. But the memories you'll take home are more than enough. Doesn't that look like fun? Katie said of the two, they were both fun, but she kind of liked the paddle boarding just a bit better. Again, you don't have to have any experience. You can do it at any skill level.